everybody! Welcome to my bathroom. Today we're going to snip, snip, snip my bangs because you guys have been wanting me to show you how I did it myself because I've commented to a few people and let you guys know that I did um, trim my hair myself and, well not my hair, just my front area right here. I'm t not confident just yet to trim my entire hair myself because I'm not at that level yet. This is basically dry cutting and I've learned this from the Diva, the Diva Sean Salon and the Curly Girl Handbook from Lorraine, Lorraine Massey and yeah I've been doing it for a while but never my whole head just the front of my hair but this is the first time like the past two months I believe is when I sip my hair a lot and gave myself little bangs so it's really quite simple if you guys have not read the book I suggest you do read the book first or at least watch some of the Diva Sean Salon videos on how they do the dry cut cutting process on curly hair so basically this is awesome for curly hair in specific because our hair is curly and you don't know exactly where the hair is going to fall when it's stretched out and straight and then when it dries up it shrinks up and you don't know exactly where it's going to be. You can't really predict that because everyone's curly hair is so different it shrinks up to different levels. So this is an awesome, awesome, awesome method for those of you who have your hair curly the majority of the time like myself I haven't straightened my hair in years I don't know exactly how the magical dry cutting technique works when they do it in the salon but somehow it ends up all being even by them cutting curls like for example this is one loop this is two loops this is three loops so I'm gonna do my bangs for you guys just trim my bangs for you guys so you guys can see how I do it and how simple it actually is my bangs are originally this long so a lot of you would think that you know my bangs would be so short but they're really not it's actually pretty long it just looks short because that's how my hair shrinks up just gonna take a hair tie and tie the back so I'm basically just kind of eyeing this it's pretty much over my eyes and I can barely see the camera right now so I'm just gonna snip a little bit and this is how I'm going to do it so I'm not gonna stretch anything out I'm looking at this one right here and I'm gonna start by removing one loop. One loop, that's what I'm calling it, one loop. This one, half the loop, because the ends were kind of funny, so it's not the same on all. One loop. And that's what I'm doing to these in the front. These I like to have I like to do it in an angle so these are pretty much right above my eyes and then these will be a little longer because I always have my hair parted on this side so so my hair falls this way this one is pretty long so I'm going to that much Now this is much 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 better and I'm probably going to leave this one like that. I'm just going to snip the very ends of this one, very tiny bit. As you can see, not every single strand of hair needs to be cut. I'm just cutting what needs to be cut, not grabbing the whole thing and snipping through. I'm only cutting what looks like needs to be cut because it's blocking me from seeing anything. So I'm going to cut just the very ends of this one because this is going to stay long perfect position right here so I can see and I'm happy with this so now I'm gonna let my hair down so that is how I cut my bangs that is how I trim them so simple so easy I'm not saying that you guys need to do this you can definitely go to one of the salons that uh, do know how to dry cut hair you can't go to like just a regular salon in your neighborhood and expect them to know what dry cutting is you have to go to a salon that does specialize in it. Just by looking at the girl doing my hair, I, I was like, you know what, I can do this. I know how to do this on myself. So I did and it turned out great. And I, like I said, I don't do my whole head. Only did the front of my hair, but it turns out pretty good on my own and I really like it and I'm gonna continue doing it. So hope this was helpful to you guys and I'll see you guys in the next video.